Hey everyone. So I want to share a weight loss tip with you today. So there's research from several studies, but the one study was showing basically this psychological and physiological connection that comes down to making weight loss, making healthy meals feel indulgent. So there was a study where basically they gave milkshakes to um, people on two different instances. And in one, they gave them a shake that was, um, they told them it was like 600 calories or something, some you know big amount, probably normal. And then they told them that there was a low fat, healthier um, version of the milkshake that was about 140 calories. So knowing that they were gonna get a healthier milkshake, they actually felt less hungry for it. Whereas the one that they were getting a more indulgent milkshake, their hunger signals actually went up. And then when they were done with the shake, the people who felt that they had really indulged felt very satisfied, felt full, they were good. The people who felt like they had had this kind of healthier shake were less satisfied and actually felt more hungry after. But the thing was that the shake that they gave them was exactly the same every single time. I think it was like a 300 some calorie shake. So they had the exact same thing, but knowing that it was healthier made them feel less satisfied. And so basically the concept was if you can make weight loss and healthy meals feel indulgent, it actually helps you to eat less and to feel more satisfied with the process. So this is something that I have intuitively used over the years because I would not stick to a diet if it's gonna be grilled chicken and broccoli and brown rice all the time. Like that's the typical like bodybuilder diet. That's what a lot of people in the gym talk about. And to me, that was just kind of like depressing. So I started to find more ways that I could make meals taste good and taste more like the stuff I wanted to eat. And I found just like the study that the more indulgent something feels, the more similar it is to the things you love to eat, the more enjoyable it is and the more satisfied you feel. So that is a very important tip for you. If you're trying to lose weight, rather than try and go drastic and do like a grapefruit diet or cut out every carb or go like really intense about it because those diets almost never work long term for people. Instead, it's about making these little swaps and exchanges. So for instance, my husband and I this weekend wanted pizza and we discussed going to BJ's brewery to get pizza, um, which is like some serious, you know, calorie carb dense pizza. Instead, what we decided to do was to um, make a zucchini crust pizza that we had gotten, put our own toppings on it, use some chicken sausage, I added spinach, I actually added some cauliflower, um, like diced up so you couldn't even taste it. I used our own cheese, I used raw cheddar cheese. So at the end of the day, we were eating pizza. Like, it tasted good, we enjoyed it, it felt indulgent because we were having pizza. Um, but it didn't have the same detriment to us, I guess, as um, something like BJ's massive deep dish pizza. So there are many ways you can do this, but this is always one of my biggest recommendations to clients is you don't necessarily need to like cut out everything and go drastic, but if there's something you really love, then find a healthier way to make it and maybe just indulge once in a while or create meals that are full of flavor and lower calorie alternatives and maybe some smaller portions so that you feel like you're getting to really still enjoy food, but in much lower calorie ways. Maybe it's a lower calorie bread or it's a homemade sourdough or, um, you know, you make your own Asian stir fry at home and, you know, cook up brown rice instead of white rice. Any of these types of things, there's so many little substitutes you can do. So that would be my recommendation um, is to just make food feel like you're not missing out and then psychologically you'll feel better about it, but also physiologically you'll actually feel less hungry and you'll feel more satisfied on a hormonal level, which will eventually over time help you to not only lose weight, but maintain the weight loss. I hope that is helpful um, to anyone who watches. So comment down below, share this with other people, and then comment too if you have any other suggestions or maybe like meal swaps that you really like that feel indulgent to you but are still healthy. So thanks for watching, enjoy the rest of your weekend, and I will see you here soon in many future posts.